With only 37 uploads, this creator has already grown a faceless YouTube channel to more than 190,000 subscribers and is earning well over $19,000 every single month. And here's the wild part. Not only is the channel completely faceless, but every video is made 100% with AI and AI automation. That's exactly what I'm going to teach you how to replicate in today's tutorial. I'll walk you through a step-by-step -step blueprint on how to launch a faceless YouTube channel from scratch and publish your very first video. One of the most viral videos on this channel combines simple illustrations, subtitles, and a voiceover to tell a motivational story. But there's a secret strategy that gives these videos extra exposure in the YouTube algorithm, and I'll reveal that to you in this video. First, let's talk about how you can actually use AI to create content with just a few clicks. Normally, you'd need one AI tool to generate images, another AI to produce voiceovers, and then a video editor to add subtitles and transitions. If you've ever tried making videos before, you already know how time-consuming that can be. But what if you could automate the entire content creation process with AI? That's where Video Talk comes in. I'll drop the link in the description and in the pinned comments so you can test it yourself. Here's exactly how I used Video Talk to replicate one of the trending videos from that channel. First, I right-clicked on the video and selected Copy Link Address. Then, I opened Video Talk, clicked on Create Video, and since I wanted to automate the whole process, I chose YouTube Reference and pasted in the link. Next, I went back to that viral video, and as you'll notice, it's running ads, which is always a good sign of profitability. I copied the video title and wrote a short description, then asked Video Talk to generate a motivational video around that topic. Later in this tutorial, I'll also show you how to design thumbnails like the ones from that channel, but for now, let's focus on how this AI automation actually works. Inside Video Talk, you can pick from different options. Upload audio you generated with another AI, upload your own script, or let Video Talk create a script for you. For this review, I let it auto-generate the script. I set the video aspect ratio to 16 by 9 because that's perfect for YouTube. And if you've noticed, most videos on that channel run between 5 and 8 minutes, so I chose 7 minutes. The AI automatically adjusts the length depending on how many images you include and how long the script is. Now let's pick the AI model for generating images. You can choose whichever you prefer, but I went with Seedream because it's a really balanced option. I set it to create 40 images, which is plenty, since the channel we're modeling usually uses between 30 and 40 visuals per video. And here's a key step, selecting the image style. Video Talk gives you styles like anime, Pixar, 3D cartoon, and more. For this demo, I chose digital painting because I wanted the visuals to match the illustrated style used in the faceless YouTube channel we're replicating. The next step is enabling the AI voiceover option to narrate the video. Video Talk gives you plenty of languages and voice styles to choose from, so you can easily find the tone that matches your faceless YouTube channel. Let me give you a quick preview of how some of these voices sound. Hey, I'm Video Talk. Hope you like the platform. Hey, I'm Video Talk. Hey, I'm Video Talk. Hey, I'm Video Talk. Hope you like the plat. Hey, I'm Video Talk. Hope you like the plat. Hey, I'm Video Talk. Hope you like the plat. Hey, I'm Video Talk. Hey, I'm Video Talk. Hope hey, I'm Video Talk. Courage is not the abs. Our distrust is very expensive. All right, I'm going to pick this voice called Ash. Once that's selected, the final step is simple. Just click the Generate Video button, and that's it. The AI automation takes over and builds the entire video for you. We gave it a reference video to replicate, set the length, and chose the image style. And now the faceless YouTube channel video is ready to go. Now, here's something important. When the AI generates your script, I recommend reviewing it carefully. You can actually improve the intonation and pacing just by adding extra exclamation marks or question marks in certain places. That way the voiceover sounds more natural and engaging. One thing I really like is that the AI even adds a call to action asking viewers to like and subscribe, just like the viral channel we're replicating. But don't click away, because in just a moment, I'll show you how to edit the video directly inside Video Talk. For now, click Next, and Video Talk will automatically generate prompts to create images that match the script. Pro tip, at least the first time you try this, 
Review those prompts so you can be sure each scene aligns with your vision. And here's the best part. You don't have to sit around watching progress bars. Go step outside, touch some grass, grab a snack, or help someone out. The AI is doing the heavy lifting for you. In less than five minutes, Video Talk has already built the backbone of your video. Once it's finished, click Open Video, and you'll jump right into the built-in video editor. We're not going to fully edit just yet, but I want to give you a quick look at the automatically created result. His face etched with a profound serenity that seemed to radiate outward. Marco approached him, his voice barely a whisper. Stay tuned, because a little later I'll also share a 30-day plan to consistently publish videos like the channel we studied earlier. But first, let's edit this one. I clicked on captions in the timeline to move them down for better readability. You'll also see a magnifying glass icon that lets you zoom into the timeline. I rearranged a few of the images so they match the script more naturally. To do this, I grabbed an image from the media section and dragged it onto the timeline. Stretching an image to fill the space between two clips is simple. Just click on the edge of the image and drag it sideways until the white guideline appears. That's how you know it's connected to the next frame. Navigating the timeline is also super easy. Just press your mouse scroll wheel sideways and you can slide left or right. These small tweaks add a more natural rhythm, giving the video a human touch that keeps viewers engaged. Now, I noticed that one of the images on screen needed a slight adjustment. So, I copied the original AI prompt, pasted it into the image generator on the left, and added the missing detail I wanted. Here's a pro tip. Always set the aspect ratio to 16 by 9 before generating images. If you skip that step, it'll default to vertical. Once I had the updated image, I dropped it right back into the timeline. And here's something important. Always save your progress as you go. Just hit the save button so every change is stored. Want to see how it turned out? In a quiet village, nestled among ancient mountains, lived a young man named Marco. He was just 24, but his spirit carried the weight of a lifetime. Marco's mind was a chaotic symphony, a relentless torrent of thoughts that never ceased. From the moment he woke, a parade of anxieties about the future would march through his mind, followed by a somber procession of regrets from the past. This ceaseless mental chatter left him feeling uneasy, perpetually tired, and utterly disconnected from the simple joys of life. He could not find calm, sleep eluded him, and his mind truly was a storm, trapping him within its relentless winds. One day, a whisper reached Marco's ears, a tale of a wise old man living in a far-off village, high in the hills. This man, once a renowned psychologist in the bustling city, had dedicated his life to helping others find inner peace. Now, in his old age, he had retreated to a tranquil haven, offering solace and wisdom to those who sought it. A flicker of hope ignited within Marco's weary heart. Perhaps, he thought, this wise man holds the key to the peace I so desperately crave. With a newfound resolve, Marco embarked on a journey, leaving behind the familiar confines of his restless mind. The path was long and arduous, winding through valleys and over steep inclines. Each step was a testament to Marco's yearning for change. Days blurred into one, until finally, he arrived at the secluded village. There, amidst a tapestry of vibrant greenery, stood a small, humble house. On its porch, an old man sat, his eyes closed, his face etched with a profound serenity that seemed to radiate outward. Marco approached him, his voice barely a whisper. If you'd like to watch the full walkthrough, I'll leave the video link in the description, along with other tutorials on using VideoTalk for AI content creation. Now, I've already shown you how to fully automate video production. By the way, VideoTalk also has a Discord community where you can connect with other creators and stay updated with their latest features and AI automation tools. Next, let's move on to thumbnails, because we all know thumbnails can make or break a faceless YouTube channel. Here's what I did. I copied the thumbnail from the viral video and asked ChatGPT to generate a similar version. Then, I uploaded both the original thumbnail and the AI-generated one into Canva. 
My goal was to compare the two and recreate a design that looked as close as possible to the original. After adjusting the colors and adding the font called Rye, I ended up with a thumbnail that was nearly identical to the one used on the trending video. All right, let's walk through how to set up a complete content creation workflow inside Video Talk. To make things simple, I've left a prompt for you in the Google Doc, linked in the description. Here's what you'll do first. Go to the faceless YouTube channel we're replicating and copy everything, from the channel name down to all the video titles. Then check out their most viral uploads and copy the scripts. Just click the Show Transcript option under the description and grab at least three scripts. Doing this will train ChatGPT to create content in the exact same style as the successful channel we're modeling. But we're not stopping there. Now I'll show you how to create your own faceless YouTube channel from scratch. And as I promised earlier, I'm going to share a secret that can literally double your chances of getting your videos seen by more people. Inside the Google Doc, you'll also find a prompt to generate your channel name and description based on the data we've collected. My personal recommendation is to create a brand new channel, completely separate from your personal account. That way you're building a dedicated brand that looks professional, right from day one. And if you want a deep dive into setting up a channel step by step, I've got other videos that cover that in detail. The next prompt will help you generate a profile picture and a banner for your channel. From experience, I can tell you this really matters. A polished channel design instantly makes your content look more professional and helps build trust with your audience. Once your branding is ready, it's time to upload your very first video. But before you do, make sure you enable the Home tab feature, where you can choose which sections appear on your channel homepage. Also, don't forget to enable playlists. You'll see why that's important in just a moment. When uploading, keep it simple. Give your video a catchy, keyword-rich title similar to the ones on the channel we're modeling. Use the SEO-optimized description that ChatGPT generated for you and upload the thumbnail we created earlier. Once the video is uploading, here's where the secret comes in. Click on Create, then select New Podcast. By doing this, your videos will also show up inside YouTube Music. This is a massive advantage because now your content isn't limited to YouTube search. It can also be discovered by people looking for audio-based content in YouTube Music. That's one of the main reasons the channel we analyzed gets thousands of views per upload. They've positioned themselves in the motivational niche while showing up in both YouTube and YouTube Music searches. And here's what that means for you. By adding your video to the podcast section, you're basically giving yourself double the chances of being discovered. Before we wrap up, let me share a few extra details about Video Talk. They offer a basic plan, a pro plan, and their Invictus plan with options to pay either monthly or yearly. They even have a one-time lifetime plan. If you want to test it out, just click the link in the description or in the pinned comment and try it for yourself. I've also included links to other tutorials so you can keep learning more about Video Talk and how to use AI automation for content creation. Now, here's something important to remember. AI is powerful, but the real magic happens when you add your personal touch. At the end of the day, a faceless YouTube channel still needs to connect with real people. That human element is what makes your content resonate and stand out. For full transparency, the demo video you just watched cost me about 4,000 credits. Video Talk generated it automatically in around five minutes, and then I spent another 30 to 40 minutes personalizing it. As you saw, I didn't use every single AI-generated image. It's about adapting the visuals to match the script and creating extra images when the story needs them. Here's a realistic posting strategy. If you upload at least two videos per week, that's eight videos a month. In six months, you'll have 48 videos published. By that point, your faceless YouTube channel should start gaining traction because you're not only showing up on YouTube, but also reaching people searching for motivational podcasts through YouTube Music. But let me emphasize this. The key is providing value, not spamming. Always follow YouTube guidelines. Don't post multiple videos every single day just to flood the algorithm. Instead, focus on building an audience that actually cares about your content and trusts what you create. And here's one very important tip most beginners miss. Warm up your channel. If your channel is brand new, spend a few days watching content on it first. That signals to the YouTube algorithm that a real person is behind the channel. Don't just create it and immediately start uploading. Do the warm-up step first. So, 
Cheers to the creators featured in this video. A huge thank you to Video Talk for sponsoring. And thanks to you for always being curious about new ways to grow with AI automation on YouTube. Remember, everything I share here comes from real creators who are getting real results. But these tools and strategies only work if you put in the effort. There are no shortcuts or guarantees, just practical insights to help you grow smarter with AI and content creation. This channel is here to inspire, not to give financial advice. Enjoy your day, keep building, and I'll see you in the next tutorial. Peace out.